morning people showing you a little bit of the footage of the corn here and the radishes and the potatoes raspberry pushes up there and of course the rest of the yard with its many 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 different plants just saying good morning to you all it's the 27th I want to say it's a uh, Thursday that's for sure <laughs> and it's my 12th day of this wonderful experiment Last night I cooked myself a dozen or so hard-boiled eggs and a loaf of bread that is made out of my radish pesto. And uh, I'm on my way off to the Sundance, which is a Native American ceremony. And I uh, might be able to give you some video footage of the way there. It's uh, forbidden to film the Sundance itself. So I will not be able to film anything once I'm there, but uh, I brought my own food. I'm only going out for the day because it is one of my relatives' birthday, a man by the name of Standing Bear, an elder within the way. And uh, I'll be going out to honor him up today. From the beginning of the trip to the Sundance to the end is a prayer. Heading that direction, you must prepare yourself for being in that spiritual place. So that's what we did. Once you reach the Sundance, the first thing you must do is be smudged off with sage and then sweat at least one round to clear your mind and your soul before entering the holy area. Hello everybody. Okay, so it's the middle of the afternoon. I'm only showing you the my <coughs> inside of the car because I still haven't gotten permission from the elders to, haven't seen the elders yet, to film out here. But I'm at the Red Buffalo Calf Woman Sundance and I just got out of the hottest sweat I've probably ever done. These stones were like four times the size of the stones at the Church of the Three at my at Manabu Farms. It's been amazing. Okay, everybody, I finally got permission, so I just wanted to show you the altar over here. Um, our lodge. That was, I just was explaining to you, they're huge, beautiful fire brims, way larger than mine. Berm, excuse me. Uh, over there is the kitchen camp, and up that way, up on top of the mountain, would be where the Sundance Mountain is. And I'll get hopefully get permission to get you footage of up there too as well. All right, guys. We'll keep. Hopefully, I'll actually get somebody on camera that's willing to talk and interview somebody about what's going on around here and how things are done. And we'll talk to you soon. There go, there's that. I just wanted to give you a quick peek at how, if you can see those, how huge those stones were. Quite larger than the ones we use at home. Okay, everyone, this is, I'd say, about a third of the way up towards the top of Vision Quest, or excuse me, of Sundance Mountain, where they're going to be sundancing up beyond those trees up that way. Out of respect for the sundancers and for those traditions, this is as far as, up, as I'm really going to bring the cameras. I just wanted to show you how beautiful it is out here, how gorgeous and how wonderful it is. Um, the Sundance actually starts tomorrow. That's why the ancestor here allowed me to film today. Um, they are in prayer though up there and below us as you can hear the drumming off in the distance. I will not be, uh, so I've got to be very careful about where I film at and what I film. But uh, 
just trying to bring you as much on this adventure as with me as much as I can without being disrespectful to these people and their ways. So again, if you'd like more information about this, look it up on uh, Facebook. They have a wonderful page. This is the Red Buffalo Calf Woman Sundance site, and you can look that up there. And uh, learn more about the ancient traditions of ancient people from all around the world in a place where they're willing to actually let you come and learn. Manabu, the art of learning. We'll talk to you all later. Okay, good evening everybody. It's like 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock at night. I'm just getting home from the Sundance grounds. Crawling into the sweat lodge and just uh, saying good night to you guys. Remember, gather with those around you and grow as much food as you possibly can.